I've heard some people say that the new extra pool is easier than the old one. I don't know if I'd go there, but I would definitely say it's more relevant for today's ham. There's been a focus shift, less on tube technology, more on digital operating that I think folks who are getting their extra today will really be focused on. When we get a new question pool, we start off by evaluating every question. We want to make sure they're relevant for you and it's got the information you need. And there's questions that they've dropped, we skim them out as well so you don't have to learn the information you don't need to know. It's absolutely not just a question swap. I go through and spend hundreds of hours working on every question on this course. Then the team comes in. They review all my material, they enhance graphics, and they add animations to make it all easier to understand. On May 1st, the new Amateur Extra course from Ham Radio Prep will be different from the ground up. Now, we've kept the same format and design. It's a video and a text lesson and quizzes, so you all get that reinforced. But we've expanded it to be 30 lessons instead of 27, and we've reinforce the material, which is now more digital related. So you get a more relevant course that's ready for you. There are now going to be 30 video lessons in the Amateur Extra course. That's three more than before. That allows us to make each lesson about 10 minutes or less and cover only 20 questions. So you can really get focused in on that information and take those quizzes and review it before you move on and learn something new. I'm really excited at how the videos are being put together. We've got a team of five working on animations, graphics, and video editing to make sure everything goes smoothly so you get just the right information you need on this 30 video lesson course. And that flows into the text lessons, the audible lessons, and the book as well. We've got all the ways to make it easier to understand so you can study the way that works best for you. If you have access to the current Amateur Extra course, you'll have access to the new course beginning May 1st. About 20% of the questions have changed, so what you need to decide is, am I going to take my test before June 30th? If you are, then you want to stick with the 2020 course. If you think you're going to take your test after July 1st, you need to study with the new 2024 Amateur Extra course. If you're already taken and passed the extra, the information's there for you. If you want to go through and brush up on a topic or read a little bit more about something, you can go ahead and read the new information whenever you want. If you're upgrading from general, I think you're going to find this is our best course yet. It's going to be very easy to follow along, very similar to what you explored with the general course, and you'll be ready to step up and be one of those one in five hams who has their amateur extra license. Yep, Professor Jim is back and I'm really excited and appreciative of all the great feedback we get from students who've studied with us and that I've gotten to meet over time. If you've taken our technician or general course, you already know kind of how it flows and how I do things and you can just watch it and expect the same thing in our Amateur Extra course as well. So go ahead and give it a try. So what's next? Well, last summer we had a lot of fun creating our HF Masterclass course and that's still there for you if you want to try it. We are thinking about something entirely different based on requests from our students. So we're not going to say exactly what it is yet, but stay tuned and you'll find out. <music>